Namekians are a very interesting race. They possess abilities unlike any human or Saiyan. They can regenerate body parts, heal others, fuse with other Namekians to permanently become one, and even create Dragon Balls. We've also seen that they can live for a very long time. But exactly how long? That's what we're going to talk about today. Hey, how's it going? My name is Raf, and welcome to Dragon Ball Code. The first time we saw a Namekian was back in Dragon Ball and they were Kami and King Piccolo, and they were both looking very old already. Later in Dragon Ball Z, we were introduced to even more of them as the main cast traveled to their home planet Namek. We also met another old Namekian by the name of Guru that was very old as well. Apart from the abilities that they have, we quickly learned that some of these old Namekians were actually super old. And when I say old, I mean old. We're talking about a few hundred years old. Let's look at Guru, for example. When we first met Guru, he was almost at the end of his life. If you would love to live as long as he did, hit that like button. But how old was he? Well, in age 261, there was a terrible natural disaster in Namek that completely wiped out the whole population, except for two Namekians, Guru and the Nameless Namekian. Since the Nameless Namekian left the planet, Guru was left with the task to repopulate the whole planet, which means that if he was alive back then and he died in age 762 of natural causes, he was at least 501 years old at the time of his death. We don't know exactly how old he was when the storm happened, but I'm assuming that he was not a newborn. I would say that he was at least a teenager or older since he had to have made the Dragon Balls by then and he had to repopulate the planet, which I also think that cut his lifespan shorter since he had to give birth to a lot of children. So maybe if he didn't have to do this, he would have lived for many more years. The same thing with the Nameless Namekian. The Nameless Namekian, which is Kami before he became Kami, was born in around age 242. In age 261, he was sent to Earth by his father so that he could survive the storm. He landed and grew up in Earth, and then in age 767, the year when Kami fused with Piccolo, he was around 532. Keep in mind that this is not when he dies. This is just when he gives up his physical body to be united with Piccolo. His consciousness still lives within Piccolo. But if he hadn't fused, I think that his body would still be able to live for quite some time. So based on their ages alone, it seems to me like a normal Namekian's life expectancy could easily be in the 6 or 700s. And also like some humans make it to 100 or more, a Namekian like this could perhaps make it to the 8 or 900s. Another thing is that their bodies seem to age similar to humans until I would say they're about 20 or 30. Because look at Dende, when we met him he looked as young as Gohan, and since then he seems to be aging on par with with them. Then, after the Namekians reach their 20s or 30s, their aging really starts to slow down. Piccolo's a little different, so I'll leave that for another video. So since they start aging so slow, they would look, let's say, 30 or 40 for hundreds of years, then 50 for hundreds more, and so on. Until eventually, they look like they're a 95-year-old human, but in their age, they would be almost 800 years old. So that's how long I think Namekians can live. Let me know what you think, and if you enjoy this and you would like to support my channel, please check out my Patreon page in the description below, and of course if you like Dragon Ball content, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you can get notifications whenever I post a new video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you later.